When we hear about carbon, we imagine coal which we burn to heat the room, to roast or to grill and burning coal produces carbon dioxide. Actually, carbon in all its allotropic forms burns in oxygen to give carbon dioxide along with the release of heat and light. Yes, even diamond burns. You know, a famous scientist had set a diamond on fire to prove that diamonds are carbon and these are oxidation reactions. When we burn any organic compound, it produces carbon dioxide and heat, kerosene, gasoline, petrol, diesel, LPG, etc. are all organic compounds. Wood has many organic compounds too. Saturated organic compounds give clean flame like cooking gas which has propane, butane, etc. that are saturated hydrocarbons and give us clean flame and produce no smoke. Whereas unsaturated carbon compounds give yellowish flame with lots of smoke. Burning wood, tire, paper, plastic etc. give out black smoke as those contain unsaturated compounds. But limiting the oxygen supply causes incomplete combustion and in such cases even the combustion of saturated hydrocarbons give out smoke. For example, in this kind of kerosene lamp there is a passage at the top for oxygen supply. Now if we block that passage partially the flame would become pale and the lamp would produce lots of smoke. So that was all about combustion of carbon. Bye-bye.